So hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum and thank you for joining today's live. My name is Safan Mustafa and I'm here with I'm here with Dr. Islam Ghazi and I am Fatima Islam Ghazi. Yes. So I think we should wait for some weavers. I think we should wait for some weavers. Okay, so let's wait for one minute. Yeah. So meanwhile, uh, let's introduce ourselves. Yeah, yeah it's here. Yeah. So, hello everyone. My name is Safan Mustafa, and I'm 11 years old. I'm a fourth grader at Dhanmoni Tutorial School, and my hobby is to make presentations. And I want to be a great presenter for my country in the future. So please pray for me. And that's all about me in short. So, yep. Now. No. no. Hello everyone, this is Takram Islam Ghazi. I'm from Idol School and College and I'm in grade 4, grade 7. In future, I want to be a great leader and in my free time, I love to read biographies and some general knowledge. So that's all about myself. So, hello everyone, Assalamu Alaikum, it's me Fatima Islam Ghazi from Vikarnison School and College and I am in grade 3. In my free time, I like to watch TV and when I grow up, I want to be a doctor. Yep. So thank you for introducing yourselves. Well, I will be hosting today's live and today this is a very important life because we're going to discuss about the very major English problems. So in Bang uh, in our country, so there are some English problems which we need to improve, right guys? Yeah, yes. you're right. You're right. So today we are going to discuss some of the problems and this is gonna be very interesting. So do let us know from where you are watching in the comment section and let us know that is our sound clear or not. Yeah. So, okay. Yeah. Today, at first, we are going to discuss about mispronounced words. Now, you know, before we uh, move to the topic, let me tell you a joke. So, uh, let me tell you a joke that is about the Japanese president. Um. So... He was taught, he was taught two words to meet the President of the United States, okay? Yeah. Okay. So, he was taught two words, with one of them is, how are you? Okay, yeah. how are you? And another one is, me too. Yeah. Now, why these two words? Because when he will meet the uh, President of the United States, yeah. so... He will, of course, ask the president, how are you? Yeah. So they thought that the president will reply that I am fine. Yeah. Thank you. And you? Uh, then uh, he will reply, yeah. me too. So they thought this and then they, uh, Japan, the Japanese president uh, learned these two English words. And then the meeting day, yeah. he went to met Clinton. Yeah. Okay. So oh. then you know Japanese yeah. people's English is a bit uh, peculiar. So yeah. it sounds a bit different. Yes. So you know that he said that how are you? Yeah. Uh, how are you? How are you? So yeah. who are you? Yeah. So Clinton understood that okay, he's saying who are you? So she thought, yeah. she didn't know that the Japanese president uh, doesn't know English. Yeah. So that's why she, what did uh, she do that? She thought that, okay, he, I think he's just kidding. Yeah. So he, she also replied that, um, I am the wife of Hillary Clinton. Oh. Then the <laughs> Japanese president replied, me too. <laughs> it means he is also the wife of Hillary Clinton. Okay, so yep, this is the joke. Yeah. So now let's move on to our topic. Now, there are some mispronounced words yeah. in uh, our English language. Yeah. So yeah. we're going to discuss about 10 
words, ten major words and very commonly used words. In so, our daily life. Yeah. yeah, in our daily life. So, um, there is a word which spells D E B U T. Now, um, can you please pronounce yeah. this word for me? D E B U T. Debut. Debut. Yes, but in our country, what we pronounce is sometimes debut, sometimes debut, <laughs> yeah. sometimes uh, de debut. But yeah. it's actually debut. Da a ba ya u. Debut. Debut. Stress debut. on ta. Yeah. yeah. Stress on ta. Debut. Okay. Debut. debut. Yep. Now. Um, Number two is B O U S Q U E T. This is another very commonly used word. Now, if I say that, how many persons in ourselves, okay, in ourselves, in the conversations, we pronounce this word? Let's say if you ask me to predict it, then I will say that. Ninety-nine point nine 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 endless nines, and percent people pronounce it wrong. Okay, so this word is actually bouquet. Bouquet. Can you tell me the words, the pronunciation of the words? Bouquet. 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 Yeah, bouquet. Now, number three. Now, this word is really easy to pronounce. Okay, let me give you a clue. Is it Jenry or Jenner? Can you tell me is it Jenry or Jenner? It's Jara. Oh my God! What kind of pronunciation is that? I think it's Jenry. No, Maybe. it's Jonra. Oh, it's Jonra? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's actually Jonra. Uh, it's not Jenry, n neither uh, Jenner. Okay. It's actually Jonra. Genre, uh, genre, okay, genre. Well, um, genre is actually a really commonly used yeah. word. Yes, isn't it? Yeah. It's a really yeah. commonly used yeah. word. Yeah. 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 Now, number four, this. This is uh, we get this in our um, when we go to the uh, uh, yeah when we go to the restaurant. Restaurant. Now this is also another mispronounced word. Restaurant. restaurant. Sometimes restaurant. we say restaurant. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. restaurant. Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. 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 Really. Yeah. yeah. So, but it's actually restaurant. 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 So now uh, let me read the comments. So, okay. So, Takrim Ghazi said good. All good. Thank you. Now, um, Zesanul Hawk Shagor said all good. Thank you. And. Money Rosaman Moni. Hi there, this is Miosha. All good. Okay, so thank you. Uh, and let me know that is our sound clear or not. So, okay. Now let's move on to the next word. Let's move yeah. on to the next word. Now, the next word is we get this in restaurants, okay? Um, so it's B U double F E T. Now, can you tell me the pronunciation, the normal pronunciation we say? Can you tell buffet. me? Buffet. Yeah, exactly, buffet. But it's not correct. Yeah. 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 It's actually buffet. buffet. And what's the, there's another alternative pronunciation yeah. for yeah, this word. Right. So, can you tell me that? Buffet. Buffet. Buffet, buffet okay? So, buffet. it's a, yeah, one buffet is the standard and professional yeah. one, but there is another alternative pronunciation, uh, yeah. bu buffet, Different. which we say, yeah. okay, normally. Yeah. And like Sunday, Monday. Yeah. Do you know an interesting fact that there is also yeah. an alternative pronunciation for Sunday and Monday? Uh, we yeah. say Sunday, sometimes Sunday, and Monday. Uh, yeah. Sunday, Monday. This yeah. is a very interesting fact. Yeah. So now let's move on to the next one, which is, okay, it's a really, really delicious food. This is an Italian food, and it's really common. Yeah. We usually get it from Dash Hut. 
Okay? Yeah. Okay. So it's actually Pizza Hut, pizza. but you know what? Pizza is not the correct pronunciation. Yeah. The correct pronunciation is pizza. pizza. What's pizza. the correct pronunciation? Pizza. 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 Yes. Pizza. 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 I want to eat pizza. Can you give me? No. I don't have money. Yes. You don't need. I have money. You just no. give me the pizza. Okay. I mean pizza. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So first give me money, then I go buy. Oh. So don't you know how to make piz pizzas? No. No. Oh. Okay, that's sad. Well, I really want to eat pizza right now. Okay. Now the last word for our mispronounced words. Yeah. Uh, is. Television. Okay, television. television. So we say television, but it's actually television. Television. Ta e la e. But instead of e, we say e. e. Tele. Tele. But it's actually Tele. television. It's yeah, it's yeah. wrong. Yeah. So television. So it's really very very. Im these are really very very interesting words. Yes. So. We have got another comment from Asma Dajin. It's hello, hi Safwan. Yep. How are you? I'm doing good, Alhamdulillah. And how are you? Let me know in the comment section. And let me know from where you are watching. Okay. Now we are gonna move to our next topic, okay. which is the magical sounds of English. Now, guys. This is a very, 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 very interesting one. Yeah. Yeah. And this can help you to develop your pronunciation 60%. Like if you know just these three sounds, you will, your words, your sentences will sound very natural. So... Can you tell me the other word which is used for magical sounds of English? Magical sounds? Yeah. It, like it starts with A. A. Yeah, it starts with A, the word. Okay. This is a puzzle for you, okay? Okay. Guys, tell me that um, in the, there is another word which we can say instead of magical sounds of English. Okay, so do let me know in the comment section what's the other name for magical sounds of English. Meanwhile, let's um, move to our second topic. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. So now, in Bangladesh, instead of pa, pa. we say what? We say pa. Pa, pa right? We yeah. say pa. Yeah. In Bengali, pa. Yeah. Do you know why we don't say pa? Because in Bengali alphabet, there is no yeah. alphabet named pa. Yeah, pa. pa. There is pa, and that's why in English we say... We connected it. We, yeah. This is one of the major problems yeah, in our us. country. Yeah. You can't mix the languages. English yeah. is English. Bang Bangla Bengali is Bengali. Bengali. Yeah. Yeah. Bengali. You can't mix it. Remember, you can't mix it. Yeah. So let let us uh there is a way to um learn these three sounds in just 2 or 3 minutes. Yeah. And this is a song uh, and we will learn it by clapping, okay? Or clapping yeah. by sniver, uh finger snapping. Which do you yeah. want? Uh, clap. 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 Like clap. So we are going to learn these three sounds by just okay. Wait. Yeah. Um, I'm well by the grace of Almighty, and I'm from Chittagong. I like your pr amazing presentation. Thank you, Asma Tajin, uh, for commenting. Yep. Uh, which class are you in? Yes, I'm in grade four. And you? And I am in grade three. Oh, grade and three. I'm in grade seven. Yeah, the eldest one. Yeah. <laughs> yes, el the eldest one here. Now, uh. Tanu Chakraborty wrote, I am uh, Arunima, I'm in pink, I'm from Dhaka. Okay, okay, good to know that. Okay, so now let's move on to our song. Yeah, yeah. yeah. let's go. So, you, I'm your teacher. 
Okay. Okay. You yeah. guys act like a student. Okay. okay. So now let's learn it by clapping. Yeah. Okay. okay. So get yourself into position. Yep. Hands up, everyone. Yep. After me, okay? Yeah. I will finish one, then you will say. Yeah. Okay. okay. Pa, pa, pa. Pa, pa, pot. Pa, pa, pa. Pa, pa, pot. Ta, ta, ta. Ta, ta, top. Ta, ta, ta. Ta, ta, top. Ka, ka, ka. Ka, ka, pot. Ka, ka, ka. Ka, ka, pot. Yes. Pa, 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 pan. Pa, 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 pan. Yeah. Ta, 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 tan. Ta, 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 tan. Ka, 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 can. Ka, 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 can. Pan, tan, can. Pan, tan, can. Yes. So, pa, pa, pa. Pa plane. Pa 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 plane. Good. Ka uh ta 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 train. Ta 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 train. Yeah. Ka 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 crane. Ka 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 crane. Plane train crane. Plane train crane. Good. Another one. Pa pa pa, pa pa pencil. Pa pa pa, pa pa pencil. Ta ta ta, ta ta tonsil. Ta ta ta, ta ta tonsil. Yes. Ka ka ka, ka ka cancel. Pencil tonsil cancel. Ka ka ka, ka ka cancel. Pencil pencil tonsil tonsil cancel. Yes. So this is how we learned so the three sounds. Now let me give you an example that it, did your English develop 60% of your pronunciation? You will know soon. Yeah. Yeah. Now let's take a sentence, okay? Like can you give me the pen and pencil please? So now if we say this, can you give me the pen and pencil please? In our normal language, we will say, "Can you give me the pen and pencil, please?" No, it's this strange. is not. This is not correct. See, can we are pronouncing ko, but it will be ko. Uh, yeah, ha. can can you? Can now you. see, it's sounding much nat much more natural, right? Yeah. yeah. Can you give me the the can pen? You? Now we say pen. But pen. it's actually pen. See, pen. we are using the magical sounds of English. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're Puh. right. Yes. And pencil. Now we say pencil. But when we convert it into just pa, it becomes yes. pencil. Now if we say the full sentence together, yeah. it will become, can you give me the pen and pencil, please? It's strange and wrong. Yeah. Uh, uh, in uh, our country, we say that can you give me the pen and pencil, please? Yeah. But the correct one is, yeah. can you give me the pen and pencil, please? Yeah. yeah. See? Much natural. Yeah. So now, there are some rules. Well, it's not so easy. Yes. Yeah. There has to be some rules. Yeah. So, now, uh, the rules are if you find pa, ta, ka, after sa. After sa sounds, then pa ta ka will become po, to, and ko. How? Let's let's see. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now uh, let's uh, say that um, a word yeah. which yeah. has ta sound after yeah. sa. Okay. Yeah. So let's say stalk. Stalk. Yeah. Yes. Stalk. stalk. But stalk. when we use the aspirated sound, yeah. it becomes Stalk, stalk, but you know talk. that we yeah. can't use aspirated sounds here. Yeah. Because stalk, because yeah. there is ta sound after sa. Remember, pa yeah. ta ka yeah. sound after sa. So, 
if there is a uh, Jerry verse, if you yeah. find pa ta ka sound after sa, then it will be pronounced normally. Like yeah. the word stock, stock, stock. Uh, American is stock and British is stalk. Okay, but when you use the aspirated sounds, it becomes stock, stalk. But you can't use the aspirated sounds here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It will be stalk, stalk, normal ta. Okay, normal ta, stalk. Now let's find a word which has pa sound after sa. Sound after sa. Yeah. So now let's say, um, let's say that spam, spam, spam. mails. We have spam yeah. mails, right? Spam. It's very disturbing. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Spam mails. So if we have pa, now we have pa. When we use the aspirated sounds, it becomes spam, spam, spam. spam. But you know the actual pronunciation is spam, 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 spam. spam. Yeah, spam. spam. Because. Can you tell me the reason why? Because pa, pa ta, ta, ta yeah. is after sa sound, after right? Yeah. Sa sound. yeah. So now the another let's uh, give let me give you another one um, which um, has ka sound after sa. So um, let's say that scared, scared, scare. Yeah, scare. I will scare you. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Scare. Now you see that when we use the aspirated sounds here, it becomes scare. scare. Isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Scare. It was scare. But when we okay, when, when we, we omit the aspirated sounds, okay? That yeah. we are not yeah. we're Good not thing. gonna um use the aspirated sounds. Yeah. We are just yes. gonna pronounce it normally. Yeah. Then what will it become? It will become, uh, it was scare, it's so scare. what will it become? Scare. Scare. Yeah, scare. Scare, right, scare. Because we omitted the aspirated sound. Yeah. 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 Scare. Yeah, so now we have lots and lots of lots and comments. lots of comments. comments. So let me read. Okay. Oh, Amiyachi, sir. Okay. So thank you, sir, for... Uh, being with us now asma tajin i'm in great six thank you for letting me know and um md yasir rahmatullah entas written has written amazing performance better mashallah thank you say thank you thank yes you. thank you yeah, thank you yeah and the magical sounds pencil cancel tonsil yes um now i gave you a puzzle remember did you find the answer it's uh, aspirated sounds. Yeah. Another name for magical sounds is aspirated sounds. I'm telling yeah. you the reason why. Now, again, uh, Yasir Rahmatullah Entaz uh, has written, learning a lot from your presentation. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you uh, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for uh, giving so many comments. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now... We are done yeah, with the, really our nice. second topic. Yeah. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the yeah. third topic is really interesting. Yeah. Because it's about fluency. Yeah, fluency. Yeah, fluency. We have to be fluent yeah. in our so, speaking. Yeah. Fluency, it's about what? It fluence. starts with G. Yeah. So yeah. can you tell me what's that? Fluency. No, no, it starts with F, but okay. it's a topic. Okay, G L O glottal glottal, glottal stop. stop. Yes, okay, yes. Well, I was supposed to tell you the reason why it's called aspirated sounds because, see, again, aspirated. I'm not saying aspirated. Yeah. Why? Because notice after sa, there is pa, pa. so it will pa. become pa. Yeah. Aspirated sounds. Aspirated. Yes. Now, why it's called aspirated? Because if you take your hand in front of your mouth, yeah. Then if you say the word pa, 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 pa. see, a wind is yeah. pushing, yeah. Yeah. So pa. Why? Because 
this is uh this is a sound of explosion p p p yeah p yeah now say t see again t uh, sound of tuh. explosion yeah you're because right. it is a wind is pushing the yeah. wind is pushing Our hand. the hand that's why these are called sounds of explosion Expl yeah. and this is called the magical sounds Sound of english because yeah. it develops your 60 percent of your pronunciation so it's a good name yeah yeah now we are gonna move to our next topic which is glottal stop glottal it's about stop. fluency if you learn it you will be 100 percent guaranteed you will be a fluency yeah. boss yeah, a boss you're right a, a boss. master yeah, yeah a master yeah so now um what is glottal stop a major question yeah many of us yeah. don't know what's the meaning of glottal stop yeah i hope i'm slow yeah you're yeah. slow yeah. enough yeah yes so do let me know in the comment section if you don't understand anything yes. I will solve the problem for you. I am 24-7 active, okay? Yes. Okay. Okay. Now, when you say a sound, let's say the P sound. Now, raise your three finger. Raise your three finger. Put it in the middle of your throat. Okay? In the middle of your throat. Now, say the sound. P. 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 Uh... Have you noticed that something pushed? Yes. Something pushed inside. Yeah. Something so has. this is an organ. Yeah. This is an organ. Yeah. yeah. This organ's name is glottis, glottis, which helps you to pronounce the words. Okay? Which helps you to increase your fluency. Yeah. Like in the natives pronounce it his bad guy. Bad guy. Yeah. Yeah. See? He's a bat guy. Ba He's a bat guy. He is a They don't pronounce they didn't pronounce the word pure D. They didn't yeah. pronounce the pure D. No. Yeah. Um they actually pronounce but inside the glottis. Yeah. Ba. ba. See that sound is here but Yeah. Not they, in outside. Yeah, not in outside. Now, let's learn where can we use this glottal stop. Yeah. There are three sounds how many sounds? Three sounds. Three sounds. Three sounds. There are three sounds with which we can understand, uh, which we can, with which we can use the glottal stop. One, ta, two, two. ka, and three, da. da. Ta, ka, and da. 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 Yes. Uh, ta, ka, and da. Yes. Now, if, there is an if. Yeah. Yeah. If you find a consonant sound after t, k, and k, yeah, k I said another oh. t, k, and d, yes, yeah. d, da. 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 So if you find consonant sounds after these three sounds, we 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 can use the glottal stop okay yeah. Yeah. we can use the glottal yeah. stop now let's take a sentence yeah let's take yeah what let's should take. we take me yeah okay, okay. <laughs> you should take me yeah okay <laughs> you should take me to the restaurant because i'm really hungry okay okay, okay. yeah so now uh, let's take a sentence like it it's not my fault. It's not my yeah. fault. Now, the normal sentence is actually, it is not my fault. It's yeah. not my fault. But when we are using the glottal yeah. stop, see, after ta, ta. sa ta. is a consonant sound, right? Yes, yeah, yeah. sa is so a consonant. the ta sound is getting omitted. We are not pronouncing the pure T. It's getting pronounced inside. In our, inside, yeah. inside. Of the glottis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. in our glottis. So when we are pronouncing, it becomes it's. 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 Now, it's. not my. See, after ta, it's no. ma. It's ma. ma. Yeah, that's so, ma. So after ta, it's ma. That's why 
what we are going to do? We are going to omit the T sound. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So now it becomes it's no. It's no. It's no. It's not. Yeah. It's not. It's not. My. It, it's normal. It's not my fault. So. Yeah. It's not my fault. Now when. Fault. Now. Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. If you have a timer in your phone. Or a stopwatch. Yeah. Um. Or your watch. Uh, you can see your watch. So now I will pronounce two sentences. One with the glottal stop and one with the normal English pronunciation. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. So I'm pronouncing at first normal. See how many seconds do I need to pronounce this. It's not my fault. Okay? Now, glottal stop. It's not my fault. Can you guys guess which one was faster? Uh, Glottal stop. stop. Yeah, well, of stop. course. Yeah. Now, guys, do let me know in the comment section that how many seconds did I use to pronounce the normal sentence and to pronounce the glottal stop. So, the sentence which I pronounced with the glottal stop. Yes, now glottal yeah. stop is. Let's take another example. Yeah. yeah. Let's say. Now, let's say that he is. Let's say that Safwan. Yeah. Safwan is a bad guy. Yeah. Well, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Safwan is a bad guy. Yeah. Now, we, yeah. you see that I am pronouncing the D. That's why T. it's getting slow. Now, when I pronounce, when I pronounce, uh, when I omit the D. 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 Yeah, that the that sound. He is a bad guy. He's a bad guy. Do it's you know why guy. I'm omitting the D? Because there is... Glottal stop. Yeah, there is glottal stop. But why we are omitting? Because there is a consonant sound yeah. after it. Oh, yeah. You're That's right. why we are omitting it. Yes. So now, glottal stop is ended. Yeah. Bye-bye, yeah. glottal bye -bye. stop. Bye-bye. Well, we are not saying bye-bye to you guys. <laughs> Don't go yes. away. Don't go away. We are we saying bye-bye to you. Bye stop. stop. Yes. Now, the last but not the least. Please. Word endings. Major, 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 <laughs> major problem. Yeah. The sa and za problem. Now, let me elaborate a bit. When you find words which end with S, S. Now, we always pronounce yeah. sa sound like so. trees. Yeah. Trees. We do pronounce, right? Yeah, yeah. Trees. Trees. Sometimes we pronounce like. Can you tell me a word which ends with S? Okay. Um, sleeps. Yeah, sleeps. Sleeps. It's okay. Sleeps. Now another. another Rest. Rats. Yeah, rats. We always pronounce this. Always. Yeah. But, do you know that we are pronouncing it wrong? We don't know, right? That's why yeah. we are here with the topic. Yes. So now, I'm going to tell you where you will pronounce sa, where you will pronounce za. Sa and za combination. Yeah. 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 Now, mm, let's say a word. Let's say C U B S. We pronounce cubs, cubs, cubs. We cubs. pronounce with the S. Yeah. Yeah. But do you know it will sound Z at za. the last, not Z, because there is a voiced sound before S. Yeah. Now there is. A rule. Every topic has some rules, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. So every reason. Mm, yeah. Every everything. Reason. So now there is, as usual, a rule for it. Yes. Now the rule is that if if you find voiced sounds yeah. before s, then it won't be pronounced as sa. It so. will be Z. So. For example, so. it won't be cubs. Cub. It won't be cubs. 
it won't end with s it will end as z as z okay it will be cubs because there is voiced and invoiced now there are two categories one is invoiced another one is voiced yeah now there are actually how will you find which is voiced and which is invoiced yeah. very easy technique well i told you guys yeah. that technique yeah. i know it yeah so show it so at first take your three fingers yep okay then take it to your throat mm -hmm. then now pronounce ba mm. ba can ba. you feel ba. a vibration yeah i can ba yes ba. I can. Yeah. and this a is vibration. voice sound and now pronounce pa. Pa, pa. It's low now, right? Yeah. Pa, pa. Like you have to pronounce it in the low scale. Pa, 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 pa. So now you see no vibration. There is no vibration. Yeah. Now, in the sound where we had vibration, these sounds are known as voiced Voice. sounds. Voiced sounds. And in the words. I mean, in the sounds which, in which we don't have the vibration, no vibration, yeah, no, no vibration. Then it is known as invoiced sounds. No. Yeah. Yes. Now let's go back to the previous place. Now we were at cubs. Cubs. Now b is a voice sound. Yeah. That's why s will be z. Yeah. Cubs. 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 Okay, Cubs. 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 So if you find um voice sounds before S, S then S will be Z. Okay? Z. Z. Oh, Z. Yeah, Z. Yeah. Zebra. Z for zebra, okay? Z. Yeah. Okay. Now where will it be S? Same thing. If there is invoiced it's sounds, opposite. just the opposite. Yeah. If there is invoiced sound before s, then it will be so. Yeah. If there is voiced, it will be so. Yeah. Yep. So now let's say cups, pucks, a uh, cup, a uh, cup, a uh, pup, so cups. Cups. C u p s. Cups. In which we drink water, we yeah. drink tea. Yeah. Or coffee. Yeah, or coffee. Now it's pronounced as cups. Do you know why? Because there is it's pa, pa, and pa, pa is an invoice sound. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you are so, right. So pa is an invoice sound, and that's why it's pronounced as sa. Sa. Now sa is finished, yeah. but there are more rules for za where you have to use za. He, um, now there is the, if there is nasal yeah. nasal sounds yeah. before s now what are nasal sounds nasal sounds like um raise your two fingers and put it in your nose yep put it in your nose now say the word ma 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 Ma. See, the nose is getting ma. vibrated from yeah, inside. Yeah, you're right. Now, if yeah. you say na. Na. Yeah, na. na. Did it vibrate? Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Now, pronounce ing. Oh, ing. this vibrates ing. a lot. Ing. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Now, these, there are three, oh, there are only three nasal sounds, okay? Ma. 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 Na. Na. And, and ing. Ing. Okay? Now, if you say pa, see, the nose is not vibrating. Pa, pa. Nose is yeah. not vibrating. Now say ba. 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 Nose is not vibrating. Yeah. Say ta. 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 Same. No. Now say ma. 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 It's vibrating. Yeah, yeah, it's vibrating. It's vibrating. Because vibrating. this is nasal. Yeah. It comes from the nose. That's why yeah. it's known as nasal sound. sound. So there are only three nasal sounds, ma, na, and ing. Yeah. yeah. Now, if you find nasal sounds before S, then you have to pronounce it as Z. 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 You can't pronounce Z. Z. Like, l let me say can. Cans. Can. 
we you can't pronounce cans. You can. Sounding weird, right? And yeah. um, you are putting your like it seems that you have you're struggling to pronounce yeah. the word. Like even I'm struggling uh, while pronouncing with yeah. s. Cans. cans. See what am I doing? But when I say cans, I'm cans. normal. Yeah. Yeah. So if you find nasal sounds before s, then it will be pronounced as z. Z. Now let's take another word, which is inflections. But this time it will be z again because yeah. there is what nasal, nasal sound, sound not before sound. s. No, no. Inflections. inflections, inflections, yeah, inflections. That's why um, it's pronounced as z. Okay. Yeah. yeah. The last rule for today yeah. is that if you find vowel vowel sounds before s now not only vowel if you find long vowel yeah. sound yeah. before yeah. s then it will be pronounced as uh. for example trees. trees we say trees, trees. but it's actually trees. trees trees see i'm struggling trees trees see, my uh, jaws are moving yeah. a lot trees. Yeah. trees but when i say trees See, trees. it's very normal. Yeah. yeah. Trees. Because before S, we have a long vowel sound. E. 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 Like there's uh, some long vowel sounds. E. e. U. E. A. Ah. And there is another word, A. Ah. Which is ah. a bit. Yeah. Yep. So this is all for today we yeah. hope you all enjoy the live thanks, yeah. for, thanks for thanks watching for our live and thank you how many comments we got let me count three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen comments oh my yeah God. seventeen comments we got in this yeah. live thank you thanks. everyone thanks a you. Lot. lots of love from us to you and thanks a billion for watching our live yeah. so we would like to end it here and stay well stay home stay safe because the situation is yes. not okay. uh, in our side yeah. yes thank you Assalamu alaikum. Say, stay, stay well, stay home, well, and stay safe. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.